With urban development, land surfaces are often rendered impermeable. Rainwater, that used to seep gradually into the ground, falls on roofs, roads and pavements, and then into drainage systems that often convey it far away, directly into rivers or the ocean. Such traditional solutions disrupt the natural water cycle and have a negative impact on the hydrology and ecosystem of the area. The natural water flow is greatly reduced, so soil becomes drier, the water level of streams and lakes falls, they may even dry up altogether, and wetlands, flora and fauna suffer. This can lead to flooding, when the capacity of the drainage system is exceeded in heavy rainfall or rapid thaw, and rivers, brooks and drainage channels are overwhelmed with water. To address this issue, new innovative approaches have been developed and tried out in recent years in order to maintain the natural ecosystem and create a more sustainable hydrology. The aim is to minimize interruption of the natural water flow by channeling rainwater from the place where it falls by the shortest possible route into the ground. This is combined with natural filtration where necessary to prevent pollutants being carried by the draining water into the ecosystem. These approaches seek to replicate nature's own methods instead of constructing huge and costly drainage systems which give rise to their own problems. Surfaces are made as permeable as possible. Rainwater from roofs permeates into lawns and is often slowed down by vegetation cover on roofs. Runoff from roads, parking areas and other impermeable areas is channeled into grassy swales and detention ponds. The water is cleansed as it gradually seeps through the soil by filtration and absorption of pollutants in vegetated buffer strips. When precipitation is heavy, it simply collects in the ponds and swales. Instead of hiding water away underground beneath a layer of concrete, we can use it and enjoy it in many ways. It becomes an integral part of the landscape and adds to the character of the area. In Iceland, sustainable approaches like these were applied for the first time in Uridaholt, a new mixed-use pedestrian-friendly hillside community in the town of Garðabær. Uridaholt is a pioneering development in Iceland, which has already received international awards and recognition for sustainability and quality of life approaches. Uridaholt lies close to Lake Uridavat. By ensuring a natural water flow within the lake's catchment area, the water level in the lake is maintained and the quality of the water and the ecosystem is assured. This is accomplished by permeable surfaces and grassy water channels by roadsides into which rainwater can drain. The water can flow from there down the hill through the neighbourhood on grassy slopes via hollows and basins into the lake. The permeable surface allows the water to gradually seep into the ground, where pollutants are filtered out and absorbed. So the water which flows into Uridavat is pure and clean. This sustainable approach to water in Uridavat's community is a pilot project in Iceland, in which a team of national and international experts joined forces to adapt their expertise and experience to Icelandic conditions. Through this approach, water gives Urida Holt a distinct character. Urida Holt also acts as a biological classroom, as it offers an unusual and fun opportunity to observe the natural cycle of water whilst enriching the local ecosystem.